Hi, today's tour is going to be on how to pimp up your USB picture and all the folders inside any folder. So that includes like everywhere. Right, first, how to put a picture onto your USB. You just go into your USB and then you'll need to create an auto run file. So, what I'll do is I've already got a picture in there which is Vans. So, you're going to need to create a text document, call it auto run with a capital letter. So, auto run dot inf. So you need to do in a square bracket, write auto run. And you need to write icon. And you put an equals sign. And then you're going to write what the icon is. Mine's vans, so I'm going to go vans dot bmp if you have a jpeg file so say if you've got we don't need that one anymore so you need to save it as inf so it needs to be you need to call it autoron.inf now once you've done that you will need to copy and paste it into your USB's root folder and now I have it here and here's the Vans logo it's it's a bitmap image say if you've got I don't know like a JPEG file let's find a JPEG file say we've got alright let's go with I oh, know this one will do this one or oh, this one this one's a JPEG so what you have to do so you'll have to open it with paint and then you'll need to save it but the way you need to save it is save it anywhere call it element or whatever your picture is going to be called and it needs to be 24 bit bitmap it can only be an icon file or a bitmap I prefer bitmap because it's more of a file that has a bit more So you need to go into my computer and you need to go into USB now copy this file. Obviously we need to change this one to element. And you need to save it and you need to click X. Now what I need to do is I need to pull out my USB and put it back in again. and I'll go back into my computer and there it is, there's the logo you can pimp out USB make it look cool and now I'll show you how to pimp up the folders inside it like I've done here right you need to get like a, a folder so I'm just gonna, I don't know, I'll just choose this one you need to cut it go somewhere and you need to paste it I'll just use a random okay, and then you go properties customize change icon now you're thinking oh I hate all these crappy little Windows XP logos you can change them you need to go to browse and you can choose any logo let's just say a desktop logo so we'll just go I don't know let's just let's just make it the Internet Explorer logo okay that one doesn't have one make it the Skype logo yeah, there, that'll do. Got a Scott logo now. Now we're going to copy it back into the USB folder. And there we go, we've got a Skype folder. You can do any icon you want, it doesn't matter, you just have to click on a like a, a file that's on your desktop or wherever, and then it'll just automatically have a logo. Now I'm just going to change that back. So I'm just going to go customize. In fact, you don't even need to do that. You just go restore default. Okay, it's not working. And you just go to the folder it was. So it's that one. And it's back to the original. You cut it. And you paste it. 
back to the original file. And there you have it, that's how to pimp out USB and all the folders inside. Obviously if you've got any folders in my documents you can just do it easily. Just right click customize and it's just easy. So thanks for watching my tutorial, I hope you learnt something from it. By the way this isn't copyright because anyone could do this.